This educational video demonstrates how to measure the pH of a food sample made of liquids and solid to comply with FDA acidified foods regulation. We will use a pickled carrots example. The pH of both the liquid and solid portions must be measured separately. Drain the contents of the food jar into a container using a sieve to separate the liquid. Record the weight of the liquid and solid portions. Blend the solid fraction to a uniform paste. If needed, 20% distilled water may be added to achieve paste consistency. Now we are ready to take the pH of the liquid and solid fractions. Calibrate the pH meter and adjust the sample temperature to room temperature before measurement. Rinse the electrode with distilled water and blot. Do not wipe. Immerse the electrode in the liquid sample and take the pH reading. Rinse the electrode with distilled water and blot, but do not wipe. Immerse the electrode in the ground sample and take the pH reading. To determine the final equilibrated pH, mix solids and liquid fractions in the same ratio as found in the original food. Blend to a uniform consistency. We are now ready to measure the equilibrated pH. Calibrate the pH meter and adjust the sample temperature to room temperature before measurement. Rinse the electrode with distilled water and blot. Do not wipe. Immerse the electrode in the prepared sample and take the pH reading. Rinse the electrode with distilled water and blot. Do not wipe. When not in use, the electrode must be kept in buffer or storage solution. We acknowledge the funding provided by the USDA National Institute of Food and Agriculture and Cornell University.